Well, we are now at the Church of the Holy Sepulchre. And uh, it's a short visit, but there is something new that you... I mean, if you are watching my videos, and you know that I'm taking a lot of videos of the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, there is something that is different now. Da -da -da. The let's enter the church. We will visit the uh, crucifixion place. We will visit the anointing table that is already back at the same place. And of course, we will visit um, uh, the tomb of Jesus as well. We are few, uh, let's say a week or two weeks after the um, after Easter Sunday, but we are a week before the Jewish Passover and two weeks before the Greek Orthodox Easter. Then I'm blessing everyone here. Of course, everyone who watched that video, but not less important is uh, Clara and Terry from the States that are taking care of Fluffy. And this is the reason. Can I show you two? Okay. <laughs> you must be part of it. <laughs> this is the reason. Say hi, Claire. Oh, you're surprised. Yeah. <laughs> there, yeah. yeah. This is the reason we actually are uh, uh, doing that tour. Then, uh, are we ready to yeah, enter? Yes, let's enter. He's going to rest. Yeah. Uh, I, I knew that you. Yeah. And um, the church, is, uh, Jerusalem Cross, is a beautiful cross unique to the Holy Land. And it's quite heavy, isn't it? Very good quality. And we are entering the facade of the church, I mean the entrance of the church, which is from the late 8, 11th century, the beginning of the 12th century. If we are talking about the Via Dolorosa, if you will climb up those stairs, we will reach the place that they undress Jesus just before the crucifixion itself. The church belongs to the Armenian Catholic and the Orthodox. And let's climb straight up to the Golgotha. Then let's do that. There are few, few tourists, but it's still empty. This is the Catholic part. That's where they nailed Jesus into the cross, but this is different. If you watch my videos, you could see that in that chapel, there was a different altar from 16th century, built by the Medici family, made of gold. Very heavy, very beautiful. They decided to bring it back to uh, Italy for one here and Americans I think you will be able to see it in one of their museums they promised to bring it back to here then let's bless it Clara and Terry can you the knocking on the wood here that Muslims for so many years didn't allow the Christians to use the bells. In their church, when they are using the bells, they are still using uh, the log. Then you had uh, kind of a procession that might start now. Um, this is where um, the Pietà, this is where uh, Mary held a poussin after the crucifixion and this is the crucifixion itself you can see the bedrock of the Golgotha John Jesus with his sin list Jesus from Nazareth King of the Jews what he's doing is touching the to the quickly. They're starting a procession that we must do it. Quick. 
attaching the bedrock for you, covering it with it. That was fast. Oh, it's an amazing procession. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. Let's go down to the tomb and you will see something special. Twice a day, they have a beautiful ceremony of the Cyrenic Church, Orthodox and Armenian. Twice a day, they are purifying the church with that. Then you saw now the Armenian one, and soon you will see the other two, which is beautiful. No, sorry, this is a Greek Orthodox, sorry. Yeah, yeah, wait, wait, let me. All right. What is that? Ah, oh, this one is amazing. What is that stone? We just came from the crucifixion place, the Golgotha, the Calvary. That's where they purify the body of Jesus. And we are blessing the cross of you, Clara and Terry, and Fluffy. On the same place that they anointed the body of Jesus. Usually I'm sending it home, but this time you will get it together with Jordi. Then let's continue straight up to the tomb. Oh, this is the Armenian one. that smell and here are next to the tomb of Jesus now the tomb is let's say not from the time of Jesus because it's been destroyed so many times but it's at the same site and this is the third one this is the church of Syria And what I will ask you to do, if it's okay by you, mm -hmm. enter with her, but stay, wait there, please. I myself cannot in, uh, uh, go in with the camera into the tomb of Jesus. Yeah, Georgina, you can go in. The tomb itself is divided into two. The first chapel with the candlelight is where um, the angel took care that no one will see that Georgine was actually blessing it for you. And the second part is the tomb itself. And Georgine will bless it for you too. I'm usually doing it by myself but uh, without the video. Then here, because we do have the little helper of Georgine, we have been blessed by that. Meanwhile, you can hear the Greek Orthodox ceremony. This is such an amazing church. energy is so strong now the energy is so strong now 
um, you can ask the the, um, uh, um, the Franciscans yes yeah, to bless it, but but be careful because the ceremony is still going on. No, well, let's wait a little bit. You can go to you uh, because I don't want to take a video of it. You don't want to take a video of it? Uh, yeah, because I, I didn't ask him. Should I ask him? Do you want... Uh, you can. Thank you, brother. Oh, it's unbelievable. We entered to the Catholic. He said afterwards. Yeah, I know, I know. But meanwhile, I can bless it here. That was the Church of Syria. Before that, it was the Armenian uh, monk who've been here. And because it's a Catholic place, they must have someone from the church that will take care of them. And you saw the monk that might bless our uh, cross for Kala um, and Terry. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you, Father.
so that when you arrive in Hindi, you can do good to him. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. God bless you. I can understand you. Clara and Terry, this is not obvious. It's not, it usually never happened. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Let me show you just the last. Um, one secret place. smell of it is amazing. The, the, that is the place that you actually ask for. This is, it, it, it doesn't look like a beautiful room, isn't it? Look at the graffiti here. It, it's horrible. It's, it's such an important place. But what you see in front of you is a, a real tomb from the time of Jesus. Then in that case, um, if someone asks himself, is that the, the real site? Because it's not, you know, today it's at, uh, in, in the middle of the city. Then yes, because the Jews have really never been buried inside the, um, inside the city. Then this is a real tomb from the time of Jesus next to the tomb of Jesus himself. And we know that Joseph of Ramitia gave us his own tomb. Then he, for sure, watch way out. Um, for sure, uh, built himself another tomb next to his master. And this is the tomb of Joseph of Ramitia. Well, that was a very important tour of 70 minutes for Clara and Terry. I'm sure that they will be surprised. And it even been blessed by the priest. And that's mainly because you are, you are. You are the, I mean, when she wants something, it's happened. And yes, I'm thinking like a man. She is really thinking like a woman. We already talked about it. Uh, it works. We are an excellent couple. <laughs> then, if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of it, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Be part of my family. And now of Clara and Terry as well, and Fluffy, and Fluffy. Oh, he's in the sun? Yeah, he's a doctor, he's not supposed to know that is, the sun is the enemy. Then thank you very much for being with us. See you in my, in our next video. <laughs> bye bye.